So scared of aggression coming out from that offlane position, but they're gonna smoke up and actually be able to or Moonlight Shadow up. They get Pilot Die as a quick duel, that's perfect, but Kezu responds. He managed to get a nice setup in coil. Tornado EMP will burn out uh, Spartan, it looks like. The slowdown of Skylark will ensure he dies as well. Maybe next time in Moderate caught together as a duo. Nothing really Moderate could do. He tries to get in the middle of things set up for the Eclipse off of the ship's Coco's Rum. I think they will manage to get that Aegis, but Puppy, in his attempt to stop Adfinim, almost gets caught, but a Yule Scepter blink out allows him to actually save his own life. MP, kind of similar scenario here. Caught out with the Aegis, but they can't actually chase him down fully. Mid one's causing a lot of havoc, especially to Madara, who's now stuck inside the Ice Wall. Does manage to get off the Eclipse, and a safe disruption buys Madara more time for that magic damage to go out, but Secret are dancing away from it, and then return to finish him off with physical damage, also catching Skylark inside the Ice Wall. They make pretty easy work of him. Puppy brought back the arrow is actually going to miss out as Yule Scepter used on. Maybe next time prevents that pullback and maybe next time is easily brought down with the Crows of Haze and the physical damage of MP. Secret win out big time. It takes two like it's been big Maxed out lead. Yeah. I mean, these are, yeah, again, like rotations that you need to be successful in. And I really feel like this is like one of the most passive TAs I've, I've seen. Like, you, you watch what most teams are doing with the TA, like, yeah, you farm it. Prioritize taking the agents as often as possible, but then you look to fight. Now Koifa has to fight. Oh, Alliance, are you going to throw away this game in a Roshan attempt? They had an Invis Templar Assassin. Now they jump in a big hit and a blinding light push out. Koifa snatched up the Aegis, and now it's clean up on aisle six. Ninjas and pajamas are going to take three heroes of Alliance, take their Roshan away. They even killed. Light mount onto the PA can be really problematic, but without those extra items, Right now, secret, they, can, they, they should be strong enough to take out Aegis, but Na'Vi uh, trying to get in there and trying to stop this. They need the swarm badly from Pycat, and if it connects pretty well, Global Silence goes down, but Roshan is still not dead. It's going to take some time. Full right. commitment. RMN makes the jump in. Static Storm laid out preemptively. Now the jump in from Dendi. It may cost him. He managed to pick up the Aegis, but he's going to lose this life pretty soon. Already two down. The big two cores of Secret. Now it's just going to be cleanup time for Navi. They're going to be able to get Puppy and a jump forward. General catches Pylai Die, gets him with the slow. The Battle Hunker, RMN, will gladly oblige with a follow up. Gets the Burrow Strike, and Dendi is here to collect that kill or not Armin. Initiation jumps forward, Global Silence is out, but Na'Vi, they've gotten themselves pretty far back, even smoking for some of those heroes in the back lines. Now General goes in big, he manages to catch MP with the blade mail with Dendi on the damage dealing. They're going to be able to finish him off, there goes a buyback, already one, maybe Puppy, that's going to make it two, another cooling blade out. Epicenter comes in, RMN hits it big time, almost finishing off Pylite, dying, getting a lot of damage on a mid one. Pagkat right on top of mid one, knows this is the big damage dealer, he needs to be able to finish him off. The time lapse goes down, oh, PA gets dropped again, mid one goes down. He has a buyback, but he's losing all of his allies here. And how can a silencer possibly stop this by himself? Well, if they have the combo stones on Pycat, maybe they can actually do it. Jump forward here. General does manage to get the call on a mid one with the blade mail still going out. He needs some he extra damage. The attacks fought on, so a lot of that damage was just mitigated. Hero's nice gonna be able blade. to catch GH, but oh, turn around, Reaper Scythe, not gonna be close again, and there's the Snowball as well, the Sun Strike's gonna come in, what a Ooh. Meteor, Deafening Blast, Matumba Man's gonna get saved by the Shallow Grave, and Bears, it looks so good, for one bright, shining moment, they counter the play of Liquid, and then it all goes to shit, it's Mir Here, Big One is swooping in behind, smoked up. Still waiting on the life stealer. They pick him up with the smoked up uh, Slardar, and they're going to come in from Sorry, behind. They're going to be able to see Kuro, and that's going to be an excellent first pick. But the press of the attack has already removed it. Kuro manages to get the Shallow Grave off on himself. And now Liquid, well, maybe Miracle. No, he pops the battle trance, turns and fights MP. MP can't actually fight that one out anymore. Mid one, he's going to be caught inside the entangle, unable to get out. Miracle hit by the Frostbite, but again, that's still an Aegis hero, so they yeah. can't finish him off with magic damage, but there was no other source of damage in. 17 minutes, Liquid on the high ground. Oh Stun boy. out instantly, double blinked on into Kezu. Mind Control gets control, but there is still the Miracle Damage. They'll get the win. Trading creeps back and forth, the Helma Dominator and the Chen. Get a Frostbite onto the Spirit Bear, trying to deal with that Sieging Hero.
He might just be able to kill it and get that 300 gold. Press the attack onto the Spirit Bear. Not going to be enough to save it. Matsu takes a chunk of damage in return, but a nice turnaround. What a crush! GH showing Kezu how it's done. Gets a double crush out. And now Secret, it's just MP and mid one. They have buybacks, but who the hell wants to use it this early on into the game? 18 minutes. Mind Control going to be slowed down now. Press the attack. Removed one disabled, but a rope removed the other. But they have to deal with Miracle. He's dealing with the melee Raxes and is still getting out. Another crush out from GH. God with a huge nuke over the top. Legion Commander finished one off. MP drops low. Miracle still has his Aegis. They're putting everything they have to finish him off, but they can't quite do it. He bounces back once again. Gets a little bit more chip damage on the range Rax. Up on Weave. But what, what else do they have? Like, they can't just let Miracle beat on uh, beat on these buildings with Battle Trance the whole entire time. They're attempting to initiate now as the Weave starts going down. They're going to Mind Control. He still has some more armor, plus the Solar Crest, the toss back by Kezu, and they get the AoE Control. Miracle, now they manage to get a duel onto MP. Miracle help Mind Control claim that kill, as well as Puppy up next. The buybacks start flowing in, but they haven't managed to kill any of the backline heroes. Mid one's going for Matu, but Puppy's already called it. GG. Secret. You just get demolished in game.